Could I fight the IRS in hand-to-hand -hand combat and win? Like all of IRS? I could probably take a couple. Like accounting, kind of a lower energy sort of. Do you think there's a lot of old people working in IRS? I could beat up an old person, I think. I think most people could. <laughs> What? Why are you guys so shocked that I could beat up an old person? Facts don't care about your feelings. School. You did performance art? Eero, you have to tell me more about that. No, dude, no. <laughs> I think I might actually rather die. Bro, literally just marching band and being a soloist and multiple forms of music stuff in school and college. Oh, I hear you. I actually did do marching band when I was uh, like 15. That was super fun. I knew it. She's a band kid. I am not a band kid. I only did it for like one year. Well, I mean, obviously not like I only did marching band for one year, uh, but I very quickly turned into a theater kid soon after. <laughs> It is worse, isn't it? Well, hold on. I'm gonna say, okay, hold on. I'm just thinking. Cause people stereotype theater kids and band kids as kind of like the losers, but I'm thinking about it. And like, dude, everybody was swimming in pussy. <laughs> the only loser in my theater class was me. <laughs> True. I mean, not not true, but like, I can relate. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. <laughs> <I was. laughs> oh man, I could tell you guys, but it's like super depressing. But like funny, but like funny because it was in the past. Everybody was a mess when they were a teenager. I don't even know what I'm saying. Like, ooh, haha, <laughs> I was such a disaster when I was a teenager. Look how unique I am. <laughs> I got cocked in an ice cream store. How much worse does it get? Ooh, it gets, oh, it's, oh my God. <laughs> it, it was pretty bad. It was pretty bad. <laughs> Do you guys want to know? Yeah, I did get cocked at my job working in an ice cream store. That is true. However, that was when I was older and a little bit this wiser. As if you're not still a mess. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not a, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not a mess. <laughs> Anyways, um, so that was when I was older uh, and quite a bit wiser. But when I was younger, I did theater tech, yeah? Uh, and I had a really big crush on this one boy. You guys know how it is. He was also like a theater kid, band kid, but he was one of the ones that was like, you know, everybody had a crush on this guy. He was like one of those, you know? The Persona protagonist? Yeah, okay, so from here on out, I'm gonna refer to him as uh, the Persona protagonist uh, of our little theater club. And I had a really big crush on him, and I, I had a, uh, one of my classes with him and his girlfriend, okay, because he, he was, you know, not single. Yeah, I was thirsty. I was I was super thirsty. Uh, and he was also in the theater club, and I did theater tech, yeah? So it was my job, basically, to hang all of the lights in the catwalks and program them. Uh, and, and program the lighting motherboard and set up all the cues and shit. It was very, very cool. It was a very high tech job. And, and there was usually like only one person who could do it during like a four year period. And that was me. It was my turn. Yeah, nerd, right? Yeah, 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 exactly. However, because I was the lighting person, I had special access to the catwalks, which other students typically weren't supposed to be. However, I didn't give a shit about anything, ever. So I would let people hang out in the catwalks and I didn't care and I didn't tell anybody. So this guy, this persona protagonist who I had a crush on, started hanging out with this girl in the catwalks who, by the way, I have to emphasize, wasn't his girlfriend. And on numerous occasions, as I'm just going about my day doing theater tech, I would walk past them having quiet conversations in the catwalks all alone without anybody and I would just feel really bad about it because I had a crush on him. <laughs> if I was older, I absolutely would have said something, but I do know that they broke up like pretty quickly, him and his actual girlfriend. So I don't, I honestly can't remember if this was before or after, but it was like in a very close vicinity. It's just, man, <laughs> it's so pathetic. <laughs>
being a theater kid, man. 